Hello, hello, you fantastically creative people from the Gordon School. My name's Dave Allen. This is my studio. And today I'm gonna to talk to you about art. Actually, my friend's art. My friend Fred in Studio Mate has a studio right over there. He does a really cool thing with slip. So he makes prints and he prints on clay to transfer images directly onto clay. And he uses wet clay to make his prints. So he's a ceramics person and he makes prints out of wet clay. So stick around, it should be pretty cool to talk to Fred. Hey Fred, what are you doing over here anyway? Uh, so I'm getting ready to do um, what uh, I call basically a monoprint onto clay. And this is the original image that I'm printing from a Photoshop file. Um, and I go very carefully and I almost, uh, it's almost like I'm, I'm going to almost tap the paint in around the image and where the print is, you can see that it'll start to resist the slip because of the waxiness of the, the ink. Um, while it's still a little bit wet, I'm going to take my image that I painted the slip on and I'm just going to set it on top here very carefully and position. Uh, this dried a little bit, so I'm going to very carefully fold it over. And then I'm going to use this soft rib that's really uh, flexible to just rub it into the clay very slightly. Um, and then I'm going to use a, a wet sponge and just moisten the back of the paper a little bit. And the area that I painted is what's going to create the image onto the clay. So I'm just going to, um, I'm just going to rub that down onto the clay so I get it nice and smooth. And it gives the wet clay, the wet clay will absorb that slip. Um, to create the image and you'll see once this is ready when I pull the paper up the image will be on the clay But you can see how now the image is transferred onto the clay and This paper just goes in the trash and then you very slowly take uh, And then once I have it in the right position uh, I basically take it to the edge of the table and I tap it on each side, and it slumps into, uh, let me get this one again, and it slumps and forms that sort of bold plate. So this is Fred's finished monoprint in slip as the clay dries in the mold. And he'll go back in and trim this edge as it dries a little bit more but then he'll let it dry very slowly and fire it in a big kiln and hopefully eventually someday it'll look like this one that he made. And it's beautiful. So that's today's piece. Big thanks to my studio mate Fred for showing us his process and sharing a little bit of his mono printing techniques with slip on clay. And also big thanks to all those inspiring people that are doing creative stuff in these hard times. Use your imagination. Stay creative, everyone.